Hello everybody, you're watching a tutorial in which I'm going to show you the data definition library of SelfV. The first thing to know is what a data definition is. It's the data you have loaded or connected in order to create your analysis. So the data definition library is the place where create and store all your saved data definitions. Wherever you are in SelfB, you can click on this button in the main header to open the library and here you find three sections. The old section is where you can create a new data definition by clicking on this button and where you find all the data definitions you saved before. As you see, for each saved data definition there is its title and three clickable icons. By clicking on this one, you can see and edit the data connection results. Oh look, a useless data definition. No problem, you can click here and delete it. If you have a lot of data definitions and you would like to isolate the ones you need more, you can mark it as favorite by clicking on the star icon so that you can find them in the favorite section. The third section of the library is Recents. Here you can find the last data definitions you worked on. In every section you find the advanced filter bar. It allows you to quickly find the data definition you are looking for, just type its title or part of it. When you click on a saved data definition, the details panel appears on the right. Here you find more information about that data definition. Now I'm going to show you how to use a data definition you saved in the library. For example, human resources. You can reach it starting from different points. Let's get back to the home page where we started this tutorial. You can use this data definition when you create a new analysis. Or you can go in edit of an analysis previously saved. Click on add and just like before connect this data definition from the box. If the source of your data definition was a spreadsheet or clipboard or notes, you can modify the data selection and when ready refine the results. If the source was a database you can go back to modify the query. It's important to know that when you connect and edit a data definition from the library, you will work on a clone of the data and there will not be any changes in your original data definitions. Hurry up and join us!